kidneys are very important organs for our body. They are two magnificent bean-shaped organs located symmetrically on both the left and right sides of our body. It is a filter that cleans waste from the blood. They turn these wastes into urine to be eliminated from our body. Healthy kidneys are crucial for regulating blood pressure, making new red blood cells, and keeping bones healthy. In today's video, what are the symptoms of kidney disease? I discussed how people with chronic kidney disease should eat and what we should do to protect ourselves from kidney disease. Do you get tired easily and experience frequent nausea and vomiting? Pay attention to the appearance of your urine, is there any change in color? Is it redder and frothier? Has there been a change in your urination habit? Do you urinate frequently at night? Is there a decrease or increase in the amount of urine? Do you feel a burning sensation while urinating? Do you experience shortness of breath and difficulty breathing? Is your blood pressure high? Do you have bad breath and bad taste? If you are experiencing these symptoms, you probably have a problem with your kidneys. Just a quick reminder this video is for educational purposes only, so do speak to your doctor if you have any medical or mental health concerns. These magnificent organs are magnificent filters that remove waste and urea from the blood, which we take into our bodies through nutrition. They work like a waste system. For this reason, it is vital that this waste system is not disrupted in order to live a healthy and balanced life. The most common disease resulting from the deterioration of this function is chronic renal failure. Kidney failure occurs when both kidneys do not work at all or do not function fully. In advanced levels, waste products and excess fluids cannot be removed from the body and accumulate. This causes toxins to increase in the body. Substances such as urea and creatinine increase in the blood, and the balance of electrolytes is disrupted. At this stage, a balanced and healthy diet is very important for treatment. Adequate and appropriate nutrition programs are one of the main factors in improving the quality of life of patients and preventing different side effects that may occur when symptoms of chronic kidney diseases appear. So how should we eat to keep our kidneys healthy? You can get rid of kidney diseases by applying the right treatments and changes in your lifestyle. Add regular exercise programs to your life. If you are not at your ideal weight, get rid of your excess weight as soon as possible. Consume the mixture of olive oil and lemon on an empty stomach in the morning. You can watch my video on this subject from the link I gave in the description section. Reduce salt consumption in your diet. Stay away from smoking and alcohol. Switch to a correct and balanced diet. Nutritional programs for kidney diseases may vary depending on each patient. Each patient has a special diet program and treatment written by his doctor or dietitian. Apart from this, the general situations that need to be taken into consideration and the foods that should and should not be consumed are as follows. Protein Proteins are generally vital for tissue repairs necessary for the growth and development of our body. The protein we need, which cannot be produced naturally by our body, must be obtained from food. Milk, cheese, eggs, meat and legumes are examples of these foods. In individuals with inadequate kidney function, these protein groups taken from outside are not excreted from time to time. This causes complaints such as nausea, vomiting and fatigue along with kidney diseases. The amount of protein consumption is of great importance. The amount of protein may vary individually depending on the person's height, weight, type and stage of kidney disease, and type of dialysis. It is important for doctors and dietitians to determine how much protein a person will consume. Salt one of the most concrete situations that occur in kidney failure is the inability to excrete salt from our body. Since the kidney cannot perform this function, the salt accumulates in the body. Excess salt can cause many side effects and trigger diseases, especially heart diseases and blood pressure. 
To prevent this, salt consumption must be reduced and, in some cases, stopped. Calcium and Phosphorus Another of the most common symptoms of kidney diseases is the disruption of the calcium and phosphorus balance in the body. When the kidneys do not work adequately, phosphorus increases and calcium decreases. Drug treatments can be applied to prevent this, but it is important to support the treatment with changes to the nutritional level. Foods rich in calcium, such as cheese, should be consumed more frequently and in excess, while foods with high phosphorus content, such as fish, should be consumed less. Water The most important nutritional habit in chronic kidney diseases is water consumption. Adequate water consumption is of vital importance to prevent kidney dysfunction and accelerate their work. The amount of fluid to be taken should be calculated under the supervision of a doctor to ensure the excretion of urea, toxins, and other substances accumulated in the blood. The amount of fluid depends on the patient's age, general health condition, level of disease, etc. may vary depending on the situation. Potassium Potassium is one of the mineral groups that play a role in the proper functioning of the heart and muscles. Too high or low potassium levels in the blood may cause different side effects and discomfort. During the stages of kidney diseases, potassium levels in the blood can become very high, which can cause many side effects. For this purpose, attention should be paid to the consumption of foods such as nuts, legumes, dried vegetables and fruits, potatoes, carrots, mushrooms, bananas and melons in terms of potassium. Oils. Fats are the food group that provides the daily energy needed for people with kidney disease, as in all healthy individuals. Since high levels of blood cholesterol in chronic kidney diseases increase kidney damage, great attention should be paid to fat consumption. In nutrition programs for kidney diseases, natural olive oil should be preferred among many different types of oils. Foods containing high levels of animal fat and cholesterol should be avoided as much as possible. In summary, to protect your kidneys, you can start by adding regular exercise to your life, increasing water consumption and reducing salt consumption. You should stay away from junk food and switch to a healthy diet. You can drink a mixture of natural olive oil and lemon on an empty stomach in the morning. When using oil, you can choose natural olive oil. You should stay away from alcohol and cigarettes. To learn more about the 7 signs your kidneys are crying for help, go ahead and tap on this video on the screen now. Thank you so much for watching my video today, and as always I wish you great health, wealth and happiness. Stay healthy, see you again.